Hello, I'm State Representative Larry Springer from the 45th Legislative District. The 45th includes the cities of Duval, Woodenville, and parts of Sammamish, Redmond, and Kirkland. We are over halfway through the legislative session, so things are beginning to heat up here in Olympia as we sort of smell the barn that's coming up here in a few weeks. I want to just touch base on a couple of things. One is a bill that I passed through the House of Representatives. It's now in the Senate, one that I'm closely following. It is a bill that would allow King County to use existing hotel motel tax revenue to bond against to build affordable housing at transit centers. If anybody looks around the east side or downtown Seattle lately, they'll see cranes almost everywhere, which means development is booming. That means the price of land is going up and that puts tremendous pressure on housing prices. So I'm hoping this bill will allow King County to use that money to increase our supply of affordable housing. The biggest issue, however, in front of the legislature right now is our budget. The House of Representatives is about to release its budget at the end of this week. We are the first budget out, the Senate comes second. So we'll be rolling out a budget probably sometime around the midday on Friday. And that budget we hope will make significant down payments on our McCleary obligation to fully fund K-12 education, restore some of the safety net cuts that we cut back during the recession years, and also provide a good deal of money for higher ed in hopes of holding tuition costs steady. So it's an ambitious budget. It will also require what we estimate to be somewhere over a billion dollars in new revenue. So that portion of the budget is going to be the most controversial, of course. Anytime you have to raise money, either through fees or taxes, it's a difficult thing to do, and we're gonna to have to be very careful to craft the right kind of revenue package, and we'll be discussing that in weeks to come. So the Senate will release their budget a week or two afterward, and then the negotiators will get together and hopefully we'll have a budget agreement by April 26th, which is to be the last day of session. So thanks again for listening. If you have any questions or any concerns, I really would love to hear from you. Uh, my contact information is at the bottom of the screen. Uh, again, thanks a lot for listening and talk to you soon.